Show uh, podcast. Cheers. Cheers. Our friend Colleen from uh, Vallison Vineyard and Winery in Galt, California. That's right. Just south of Sacramento. Yep, pop, skip, and the jump. <laughs> and north of Stockton. Yes. And uh, just slightly north of Lodi. Yeah, that's way. correct. Yep. But you're Lodi wine country. Yes, we're yeah. Lodi AVA. Right. So uh, you guys have only been around for uh, close to a year now. Yeah, we're coming up on our one year anniversary. Um, so we're really new to the right. area and to right. the wine region. Right, right. And uh, we started hanging out uh, at, at Vallison uh, a few months ago yeah. and, and uh, taking video, taking pictures. You guys have such a gorgeous location. You really Thank do. Thank you. Yeah, it's, it's very unique. Uh, we are uh, situated on a 15-acre water ski lake uh, surrounded by 11 acres of Syrah Vineyard. Mm -hmm. So it creates a nice setting to sip your wine. <laughs> yeah, it does. Uh, it, it's It looks like a beach. It yeah. looks like it looks like somewhere else. I, I Before I came out there, I had a friend show me, and I was like, where is that? You know, because I was thinking, that, that just doesn't look like what I think of golf. Right. I'm not, you know, just, I haven't spent a lot of time in golf yeah. in my life. I, I well, drove see, by it. You're but, spending uh, more time now. Yeah, 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 a lot more time. And uh, it, that, that winery uh, that you guys have is just uh, an incredible experience for people to come and relax. Yeah, uh, you're open you. Thursdays, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays. Correct, yes. And uh, you have live music on Thursdays, Fridays. Yep, Thursday, Fridays, and then once a month in the summer, we do one Saturday night. Okay, mm -hmm. and then uh, the other thing that's really unique about you guys is it's a ski ranch, too. Yes, yeah, uh, so and we do water skiing. We have a yeah. slalom course right on the lake. Um, yeah, so beautiful. if you're sipping your wine uh, on the beach, you may be lucky enough to view some water skiing as well. Yeah, I got to hang out in the boat a few weeks ago, yeah. and that was kind of fun. Yeah. That was a, you know, a blast fun. and then uh, you also have uh, uh, paddle boats out there that folks can hop into yeah. with a bottle of wine yep yeah it takes uh, it um, holds up to four people you can rent the paddle boat for an hour and go out and sip right. some wine and yeah. you know get away from everybody yeah. <laughs> it's such a unique experience that you guys offer because yeah. there's not a lot of wineries in the area that I can think of that are on the water right yeah and that so, definitely sets us apart yeah, yeah. It, was that part of the plan when you guys said hey we're gonna do a winery and we've got the lake here yeah already? Yeah, we saw yeah. the property and said, okay, this is right. this is something special. Yeah, so. and, and it definitely is. And it's yeah. you got a beach chairs all the way down the beach there that you can sit yeah. in and, and uh, grab whoever you're hanging out with and, and grab some wine, uh, have yeah. a bucket of wine, a bottle of wine, and uh, just kind of sit there. And then you guys yeah. usually have food trucks uh, out at the location as well. Yeah, so one um, important thing when sipping, tasting, drinking wine is you want to you know you get hungry right. so yeah so we have a lot of great food truck partners um we have a food truck every day at the winery mm -hmm. we also order or offer excuse me a charcuterie board so right. boxes through delicious boards right. um so those can be purchased too on site right and then the thing uh, that i that i've noticed is you can do events there right? yeah. so if somebody's having a birthday party and you want yeah. to do it there yes. all they have to do is get a hold of you and, and they can reserve a time to uh, have their celebration yeah we have a couple different options for engagement parties bridal showers mm -hmm. um we offer uh, private events. We just started to offer them, and uh, behind our ranch house, it's a really Good. nice shaded area, flowers, awesome. big trees, right. um, and then you can also have uh, an event in the winery location, right. also. Right. And then the other thing I've noticed about you guys, probably because I, I do some of it, yeah. uh, is you guys are all over social media. I we mean, are, you guys yes. really have the A game going yeah. uh, with Instagram, with Facebook, with TikTok, with uh, yeah. you know. I, I mean, it's really great to see because you guys see what you're all about right there. All you right. have to do is see one video or one picture and you go, wow, I yeah. gotta I gotta go hang out there. Yeah, we um you know we have a lot of different great wines. All our wines are boutique, small volume. Mm -hmm. Um but we want people to also see what you know they can see on right. the property and right. sit and relax and fun atmosphere right. um to enjoy our wines. Right. I, I think the the great thing is is you've got the the wine, obviously mm -hmm. uh, great. I tried the mango peach. Yeah, peach mango, yeah, that I is think, a favorite. Yeah, I, I couldn't stop drinking it. It yeah. was so good. And I didn't think I would like it, you know. Yeah. And it was like, you know, so some of the videos you see yeah. of it being poured into a glass, those were like the twenty fifth tip. It's actually like emptying, right? You're, yeah, you're just sitting yeah, in the exactly. background emptying it. Well, you, have, you know, when it doesn't work, you have to do something. You have to drink more so the glass is empty to right. pour it back into the glass. Yeah. And so that's exactly what I did. Uh, you guys have like a patio deck too. I yeah. think. Uh, that's right there yep. and, yeah. and you can sit right there on the water on the patio deck with a, a large group of people yeah. you know say so you have a family of six or six friends yep. and uh, so that's great too yeah right? it gives a, a different um, different experience on the beach side you're kind right. of over the water right. so yeah and you right. can sip and relax your wines there too right 
And then, you know, like we were talking, the live music that you guys offer uh, yeah. Thursdays. And you open at 3 on Thursdays. 3 on Thursdays, live music starts at 5.30. And then we open at noon on Fridays, and live music starts at 5.30. Okay, you open at noon on Fridays. Yes. I, I was wondering if it was 3. I couldn't keep yeah. the time straight. Yeah. So now I know. I know. Now <laughs> yeah. I know. I'm learning things, too. And uh, and so you guys are coming up on the one-year anniversary. Yeah, yeah. Uh, is, is it the vision that you had, you yeah. know, when you started? It is. It is the vision we had. Um, we gotten there a lot quicker I would say mm -hmm. than mm -hmm. we had anticipated which is great we have a lot of loyal customers right. and new yeah. people still learning about us every day right. um, so we've had a little bit of growing pains you know like parking stuff sure. like that sure. so, yeah. but um, it's, well, it's been fantastic I think you guys have gotten bigger faster than you thought you yes. would right yes. and, and so I mean that's the parking problem that's yeah. a big problem yeah. that's a, <laughs> that's a bad problem, problem. yeah good and, problem. and the thing I've noticed in, in people commenting to me personally and, and on social media is oh wow I didn't know that was there yeah, we and, get that a lot. yeah I didn't know <laughs> Such a lovely location was there yeah. for one. I got to go check that out. Yeah. Uh, and so I think you guys have created your own buzz, yeah. which I mean is is great for a new winery because you think yeah. of some wineries are, are around for generations, right? Yeah. And you guys stepped into it a year ago. Yeah. And uh, but you have such a lovely location, such a unique location. Yeah. And I think it makes the experience a little different than anybody else. It does. does. And people want to share that they've mm -hmm. been there and share with their friends, right. and then they see it, and then their friends come or they bring their friends, right. and that's how. We grow. It's kind of this, uh, you know, word of mouth winery. Right, you know, word right. of mouth on social media. Right. Word of mouth of people coming, and uh, yeah, yeah, it gets passed on. Well, I think it, it's just great. And I mean, every time I've been out there, uh, you guys offer first class service. Yeah, thank uh, you. And people, we've interviewed people that are hanging out there, and they're really enjoying the experience. Yeah. They're really having fun. Yeah. You know, it's not. It's not like they're just putting it on for you know the camera because right. somebody's taking a picture. They're enjoying. I, I remember talking to a few people that came from Las Vegas. Yes, to yeah, check you guys I out. Remember that. Yeah, and I was like, wow. Uh, yeah. You know, and, and obviously, they'd seen you on social media and said, wow, that's a place we got to go check out. Yeah. And so these aren't people that were next door and they just like you know decided to hop on over. These right. are people that made a, a definite plan to come out there for the weekend. Yeah, and, so and that's good. we try and make everyone's experience. Um, you know the best it can possibly be that's our goal so our customer service our location our wine all of it combined yeah. um, to give a great experience yeah and, and then the view on the lake is just so beautiful yeah. that you could just sit there and, and have a glass of wine and and you know sit there and relax and and kind of unwind from your work day yeah. or whatever's going on and uh, what a unique experience and then the live music, I think, offers a, a nice component. Yeah. And then you can really yeah. unwind, you know, on a Friday night right. and Thursday night right. and relax and yeah. just, you know, dance yeah. whatever they want. And you have the fire pits there, so mm -hmm. as it gets dark and maybe a little cool, you can have a fire pit yeah. and have some wine around the fire pit. Yeah, so we do great. s'mores out there when it's cooler out. Right, uh, right. But yeah, yeah, for sure, people yeah. like that. <laughs> yeah, so you definitely got to check it out. Vallison Vineyard and Winery, it's in Galt. It's uh, Lodi wine country, but it's yeah. before you get to Lodi yeah. or after you've been in Lodi, yeah. it's back up this way. And uh, you're talking about... 20 minutes, 25 minutes from Sacramento. Yeah, it's really, it's really close. Um, we've been getting a lot more Sacramento people coming yeah. to visit us, so yeah. Yeah. Now, do folks need to call ahead for a reservation, or how does it work? Yeah, I would definitely suggest making a reservation. Um, okay. They can make one online, and they can pick the spot in the winery that they prefer oh, they to can? sit. Yeah, okay. we just started doing that, so if they want the chairs, or the right. picnic area, or the dock, uh, they can pick that online and pick their time, okay. and we do reservations for two hours. Okay. Um, yeah, and it's a yeah. great time. Yeah, and I mean, now you can host your event there. If you have something yeah. going on, a celebration, an anniversary, a birthday, or you're just wanting to get the gang together yeah. <laughs> uh, for an after work uh, little happy hour. Yep, we do uh, corporate good, events also. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. exactly. So, uh, and what's the way to uh, get in a hold of, of you for a corporate event? Yeah, the best way for events is to email us at info at and that's on our website also. All right, so uh, you got to check it out. Uh, and, uh, of course, we show you all the time on our social media how great of a place it really is. Colleen, thanks so much for coming into the studio thanks, today. Thanks, Rex. I appreciate it. All right. <laughs> we'll catch up with you in just a little bit. It's Rex on the Road.